All right, here we are back again. Super low key stream tonight. Not really worried about the opening or anything like that. Just interested in playing the game for a bit. As we once again start it over. There we go. Alright, if it doesn't behave this time, we won't be playing one shot, unfortunately. But I think I may have finally fixed it. Dude, dude, dude. Hello. Yes, hello indeed. Off we go. Enjoy that TV remote. Okay, green zero, red one, blue seven. Green zero, zero red one. I can't. That's all right. We'll just go look again. Green zero, red one, blue seven. Blue seven, green four. Access denied. What did I get wrong? Oops. Oh, green zero, four yellow. Okay. Hi. How about that? There we go. Okay. Once more, with gusto. Boop, 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 boop. Our actions. That's better. Now we're able to continue. All right, here's the sound of a door unlocking. What could that be? Pray tell. Go ahead and grab this branch. Do 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 do. Nobody here yet. Perhaps at all. Ah, yes, the bottle of alcohol I keep in my fridge. Doot, 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 doot. Get that branch in there. Hello, SSD Ninja. Nice to see you as always. You are happily just in time for the uh, proper playthrough of this game after uh, a lot of. Yes, I should have uh, consulted you first. Or at least asked uh, the community in general. I didn't know it was going to quote unquote uh, personalize the experience. And as I don't want my real name out there. <laughs> this is our third attempt at starting. As I had to reboot the computer quick and change my user account name. I am playing window. Does it not do that if I'm playing full screen? Or, uh, yes, I did heed that warning, because I do get, I have gotten a pop-up so far, as I play, I played this a little bit. Okay. I was in midst, the midst of my first real conversation with the robot when, uh, they started dropping personal info. Which I have since corrected, and now we're... We're doing a proper play by play. Do, do, do. I think it's silly that even though I'm holding this thing, I have to equip it because I'm clearly holding it. Windows is good. It is more important than they let on. Oh, dear. Is there going to be a way that um, I'm going to be able to show that to the people watching, though? Or I'm just going to have to communicate that verbally? All right, out we go into the world. There's that big old tower. Jeepers. So just go ahead and, uh, go ahead and climb that sucker, huh? From what I remember, there wasn't really much going on. I was just sort of cruising around looking at beating up robots before talking to this friendly one just over here. 
just go ahead and get that conversation started because that's where we were. Oops. Hello there. Mm -hmm. Yes, we are here. I am your savior, apparently, because I wandered out of a building. Holding this sucker. Mm -hmm. Woke up in a weird house. Got ourselves out of it. Just as the prophecy foretold. Okay. Let me ask about the computer, because this is where bad stuff started uh, being shared. There you go, yep. There we go. Yep, that's me. My one and only name. Jeez. Rad will provide guidance. I wonder if that changed. Okay. Didn't change the directory on my computer. But it changed the name of this account. No problem. Sheesh. Here they are, communicating directly with Rad. What if I do this? Should I have just been able to... I mean, I could have, I guess, chosen another name, but it would have already dropped it several times. That's me! Hello, Nico. I am Rad. I actually heard someone. Does that mean you're aware of what I'm up to? That's interesting. Truth. Yep, that's what I'm here for. Okay, so that was... Alright, so tell me about the light bulb again. Yep, it's our new sun, which seems like a lot of responsibility, but we're up for it. Let me also jump back into my Discord so that my big dumb head lights up and I chat at you. This is what happens when I have to update, or excuse me, restart the computer. It's like any other technical difficulty that I would have had to deal with. Phosphor! Absolutely, we will be increasing our phosphor reserves as quickly as possible. Mm -hmm. Thus begins our pilgrimage to the tower. There we go, let me get myself in there. Take a sneaky peek. Did you update? Did you update? Huh, huh, huh. Not yet, hey. Oh well. The sun shatters the world will end in an instant. Tell me about the world at large. There we go, there's my nice little border. Everything is super dark. Was never as dark as or as broken. Three regions, okay. The barons. The tower is at another region. Just the tower region. The center. A map in the outpost somewhere. Yeah, how do I get the heck out of here? Aw, oh, man! Just wanna get home. How old are you, Nico? Hmm. Unable to help you on the programming, huh? But I am programmed to empathize with your struggle. Oh, you have to ask about everything. Okay. Oh yes, I also forgot that I can run. I'm gonna make a lot of use of that. Run, 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 run. Here we go running around. I wasn't kidding about it being dark. All right, let's check out this building. Her. Uh -huh. Password. Turn on. What's all this on the floor? What is these? Seems to be okay, just doesn't have power. Cool. Dusty shells. More dusty shells. Is this another fine robot? Just another robot without power? Oop. Hello. The 
The use of a robot as our replacement hen engineer seems unorthodox, especially the one responsible for last year's incident. I suppose they had to get her away from the city, but that doesn't make it any easier to swallow for those of us who work here. I hope that man knows what he's doing. Hmm, so they put a robot in charge? And bad things happened. Ooh, this must be glass from the way this thing... I'm checking all these shelves. One of them might have something. Yeah, it's a very pretty game. I really love the art style. Five new positions available at the mines. Housing and other provisions are included upon hiring. First come, first serve. All right, so they want people in the phosphor mines. They're willing to reward handsomely for it. Reminder to all workers, the rarest, rarest form of blue phosphor is found during the phosphor shrimp's spawn period. If you observe a pond with a bubbled over surface, please contact management immediately. We will dispatch a harvest team ASAP. What does that do to the phosphor shrimp, if I may ask? Does that destroy them as you are ripping up their habitat, or is that not a concern? Self-charging solar battery model N87, one-year warranty included. Simply place your self-charging battery in full daylight with the lens facing up. Charges in seconds, no external power is needed. Troubleshooting battery manual. If the battery fails to charge, check to see if the lens on the front side has not been dislodged during transport. One charge cycle will last about 10 days. If you notice a decline in the charge cycle within the warranty period, please contact the manufacturer. This box looks interesting. What's this next to it? Is this not a pry bar? Oops. Does that not look like a pry bar next to it? Anyway, it could be just shading on another object of some sort. Oh. One, a robot may not injure a living person or through inaction allow a person to come to harm. Ah, Asimov. A robot must obey the orders given to it by people except where such orders would conflict with the first law. The three laws of robotics. A robot must protect its own existence as long as such protection does not conflict with the first or second law. Map of the Wild. All right, we're on the outskirts, the barrens. We need to get to the glen and then into the refuge. And then in the very center of the refuge is our tower. Okay. I will pry it open with this empty bottle. Can I use you? Yeah, that's fine. So no. All right, let's check out this room. Urgh. That's lighting up all fancy. Faded ink. Able to provide power to all robots and machinery in the area via a large electromagnetic field. The first live one is smash that like button. Yeah, smash, follow, like, and subscribe. Maintenance efforts are quite high as expected. We have provided customized backup cells for the few most important robots. Their electromagnetic fields are much weaker and the signals are highly specific. In other words, these small cells can only charge one single robot. A lot of small glowing shrimp swimming in a jar. Small machine, wonder what it does. If I don't have this equipped, can I just pick this up then? No. Okay. Oh, what do we got here? Big machine. Doesn't seem to be doing anything though. There's a rectangle shaped hole in the middle. Use, looks like something used to fit in here. Dusty shelves. Some sort of small machine. Yeah, can I not just grab those? Give them a little, a little grab a do. Yep. Mm. Okay. Dusty shelves again. And so on and so forth. Alright, what am I missing? 
What can I pick up? I can use. To cry. These are all just empty shells. Maybe I gotta I get over to the other building first. Hello, can I borrow your staff? I don't imagine that was one of the questions, so I'm not gonna trouble him. I can always go back. All right, let me check this ominous looking structure. Jeepers, I hope these are all unoccupied. All right, they're at least shut down. Metal presses. Okay. Oh, I love the likely footprints, or footsteps, I should say. So cute. More metal pressing. Hmm. Oh. Can I not? Again. Can I not just grab stuff? Yeah. Grab one. And then use it to pry open that other thing. Just ahead. What's this? Then take it! If it's, like, if it's not even recognizable, and it looks like a little crowy bar thingy, just grab it. Don't be shy, Nico. The faster you figure, we figure this out, the faster we can get you home. Oh, this one's still active! Oh dear, oh dear. Oh, this bit. Well, I don't have any metal to put in this thing, though. It's still running. Yikes. Why would you want to smash the bottle here? I don't know. Why anything? Uh-huh. Please pick up anything. Yes. Absolutely. Grab a hunka hunka. RT Miss, thank you very much for the follow. Appreciate that. We are experiencing one shot for the very first time. Doing our best to work our way through these little puzzly bits. So far. Much more questions than answers. And a good sign of a good mystery. All these poor robots. They seem to be in working order, except there's no power to this entire planet. I feel like that's what I gotta do here, is screw this reactor, or sun they call it, back into... Hello Moshi, lovely to see you! Doing great! Oh, Ninja summoned you, did they? My thanks again, Ninja. Okay, let's see if we can help our little gender-neutral friend here find out what to do next. So, the first two buildings, I had a lot of dead ends, and now it's just a whole lot of... a whole lot of nothing. Game of the year, all years. Ooh, that is high praise. I mean, I was looking forward to playing it when I... before I even started. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh no, I just picked a direction and ran with it. I don't know where I'm going. Let's find out together. Oh, that's important. Pieces of paper. Hot diggity. That means more story elements. Help me, robot manual. Help me. Also, what's this little rock? Nothing. The sun will not return. And the abyss is calling my name. I'm sorry, everyone, for choosing to leave before the darkness suffocates us all. Oh, it's a suicide note. Neat! <laughs> Glad I found that on these precarious cliffs. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, dear, dear. What's going on here, though? Hi! You look useful. A metal safe. Locked up with a six-digit code. I do not remember any six-digit codes anywhere. Okay. 
That was it. I'm so glad all of you are uh, are showing up now, and not when it was spitting out my uh, my government name, as it were. I fix that problem. Do do do. Ooh, where to run? Where to run? I guess it's good. Okay, that's where it came from for sure. I remember all the twisty turny bits. East is always promising. <gasps> yes. Although the poisonous gas is highly localized to the vent zones, barren workers are still recommended to wear gas masks. These masks were mandatory around active vent sites, of course. As more and more of the workforce got replaced by robots, we found ourselves with a surplus of abandoned gas masks. It seemed like a waste to get rid of them all, so we kept a few for emergencies. Okay, so to me that means there's going to be a gassy area somewhere, and I'm going to need to find a gas mask in order to survive it. Thank you for the veiled hint. It's future troubles. Ooh, birdie. Yes. Radalicious nodes. <laughs> yes, and I certainly don't want that spread around. It's like Jughead. There's more people knowing his real name. Drives the girls cuckoo bananas. Alright, so. I didn't really see any other doors on either end of this. It was just a multi-layer of uh, like warehouse space. I gotta find something to put in that press. I checked all the little bits of metal and stuff in here and, and there were no takers. So let me run on back to the only other building I know exists with our little robot pal. Hey buddy! Just doing a little, uh, doing a little patrolling? Oh yeah, look at you go! Oh, sorry, let me get out of your way. Yeah! Had a boy. Get your steps in. Woo! Come on back! Oh no! Fake me out there. You got the moves, bud. You got the moves. Okay. I gotta find something to pry this open, which I'm assuming is gonna be a bit of metal that I then smash in the metally madu metally, you know, that machine that's working. Yeah, that, I don't know how long that robot's been there with its uh, programming just to answer questions of mine. Poor thing. Can I grab one of these little metal stools and crush it? Can I grab this? All of this debris I would like to interact with if possible. Or this shelving unit. Hmm. I'd like more items in my inventory, please. Okay, and if I go into the second room, I have these little glowy friends. Small glowing shrimp swimming in a jar. And then this thing's working. I wonder what this small machine does. I can feel my hair standing up a little. So it's like electrical. Or maybe I need to get a piece of something or other and squish it into a rectangle to shove into the rectangle hole here. Doing anything? Rectangle shaped hole. So all I have are questions, and I have no answers. I already checked all these bookshelves, they're all just dusty bookshelves. This I feel is just like debris or decoration or clutter in some manner. There's not a lot of indication that there's extra rooms or something that I'm missing. And I don't have anything. I had an empty bottle that used to contain alcohol and a light bulb. A large light bulb! It's the sun, but it doesn't make a difference if uh, I have it equipped. When I interact with the two things I can interact with. And they definitely don't want the bottle either. I can't possibly be at a standstill already. Let's go back to the other building I know exists. Which is the house we started in. I don't think there's anything more in here, though. But it's honestly the only other place I know has anything in it whatsoever. Hello? Oh, maybe not. It's the server room. Oh, we can't even go back to where we started officially. That's unnerving. A weird place we woke up doesn't exist anymore? This is all unexplored, too. Whoa! Gee, I hope this game's open world and non-linear. I'm just gonna go exploring. Whoa! 
Hello. Let me get a good wide look at you. Hi there. I wonder what services you offer by boat. Shrimp. Are you a shrimp boater? Hi there. <laughs> yes. I'm here. Ah, okay. Right. Sure, but that seems like a, a later problem. Look at all these fun pools of stuff. Places we're both used to dock. Aha! Hello? Oh! What are you? <gasps> A metal pipe! Hot diggity! I can use that later. Uh. Sure! Does that save it? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. It just closes the game. This game's silly. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. By little nap, they meant just, uh... Nicely done, a robot. Whoa! Coming back to their dream! Oh, I hope this is broadcasting. There we go! There! Everybody enjoy this for a bit. I mean, I'm aware that closing the game is how you save, but I didn't know that that's literally the only way that they would save, and that they would do that to me in the process of saving the game whilst I played. That's interesting, in a way. Wish I'd known all this beforehand. Anyway, what a cute little piece of art here. But we gotta get it back to our one shot at everything. Oh, let me... Oh! I didn't know this would be a whole story. Yeah. Is this like, um, are you dreaming of your homeland? Is this where you came from? Okay. Yeah, I'm still here. Oh, I couldn't answer no, I couldn't lie. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> okay, I can forgive you a little bit, but... Maybe don't close the game next time? Hmm. Whoa, a really real sun. Nah, probably not. Uh... Hate to break it to you. Never mind. Never you mind. Sure does. Yep. Hmm. Again, I don't know. I indeterminate age. Like how the sun and the moon and stuff works. Yeah, let's bond a little bit. You go to sleep during the day? Are you like cat people? But some people stay up and use computers. Okay. Well, thank you for that. More or less. Okay, now I have this light metal rod. Let me haul butt back to see if I can pry that container open. Run, 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 run. Your cute little self. Run, 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 run. Cute little footprints. Wish, 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 wish. Hi, everybody. Excuse me. Excuse me, I just gotta dip around these craters real quick. Wee, wee. Over here. Oop, past your little loading screens. Hey, buddy. Thanks, I just needed you to scoot away from the door there quick. Hi. No time, no time. Let's do it. Flatten it somehow, you say? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Time to beat feet. Do, 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 do. Don't worry, we got this. You don't want to get too close. You're doing okay. You're doing okay. 
Um, what prompted me to choose this one in particular? I, uh, I don't know. It was in my list of, um, from that big old uh, Ichio bundle ages ago and just looked at the page because uh, I had just finished uh, Double Cross last Friday and figured I'd give it a whirl and just look cute. That's generally what I go with. Nice looking aesthetic, and if there's a write-up that uh, details some of the gameplay and it seems interesting or, you know, out of the box thinking or anything like that. Now we got a crowbar. Ha-ha! A little metal cube and some broken glass. Solar battery. Oops. Hang on. Can't combine them. How do I shake out the broken glass? Nothing? How about this? Hmm. Still no good. How about this? Nothing happened, so I gotta fix the battery first. So you're telling me I can't use... Feels like we're on the right track. I had to go so far, and now I'm stuck again already. No problem, though. Let's just run back. This a wise. This felt like a fun experience. So I'm still really looking for in games. It's an interesting experience. doesn't have to be too complicated. doesn't have to look the prettiest. Not that this game doesn't look great. I just mean, overall, when I choose games, yeah, just something that tickles my fancy. I can't really describe 100% what that's going to be all the time. Okay, so past this. <sighs> Hello? Don't mind me, I'm going to run a lot. Here. That's where I need the gas mask. Okay. Can't go too far that way then. At least not at the moment. What about... Okay, can't get past that. Any other... Territories we can investigate? Nope, looks like we're going south again. First show up. Mm -hmm. Well, we can only go to the east to visit our robot buddy. Hey -o. Well, let me go double check see if you have any more fun questions or anything. Sure. Oh yes, please tell me more about other things. Yes. A little on the nose with the naming, but that's that's to be expected. Unaware. It was not built to wander, just to sort of circle this doorway. Robot friends. Yeah, I was gonna say, how did they even like why would they even want friends? I think they're okay. I have not been tamed. I don't... I don't quite understand what that means. Moving on. Oh, I guess I could ask you a few other things. Sure. We did the Barons. Tell me about the prophecy. Savior will arrive from another land. Check. Strange house. Check. Find the sun. Check. Illuminate the world. Pending. Pending. Yeah. by your programming and you're programmed to recognize the prophecy that somebody programmed into you now let me ask you about the last thing How? not allowed to answer in 
time Rad will know what to do. Well, that's comforting. I hope they're right. Okay, now we go past this place because we haven't been past here before. Hello? So many giant craters. So pretty. Alright. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, six digit code safe is around here. Um, what else? Whatever's going on here. I can't get close to it, though. This is all new, I think. I certainly haven't been this way before. Whoa! Hang on! The world changed color. Oh no, stinky stinky. Yeah, bad, bad, bad. You got it, you got it, let's get out of here. Can't go too far north, unless we have that gas mask. Maybe that's how we get out of the barrens and into the next area. Okay, nothing about these, that's fun. Hmm, I feel like we've exhausted this before. I can't possibly be lost. Well, I can be stuck already for sure. That's so I roll. Okay, I'm down at the bottom. I guess I'm gonna go check out that area that where it changed color, but I don't know if that also meant gas over there or not. Don't have the six digit code for that sucker, I can tell you that much. Uh, oh! X, 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 X. Well, those are technically six different digits. With the mining operation going smoothly, materials are no longer a limiting factor. We will be able to build more resilient robots both in body and mind. Specifically, the discovery of Metal Alloy 291 will likely allow the development of highly efficient circuitry. 291. I'm going to remember those three digits. So there's going to be more bits of paper scattered around, huh? Like, I think I've seen that one already. That one was about the... That one was a suicide note. <laughs> Suicide note. Yeah, I don't want to read it again because I already went through that for sure. Yikes. All right, let's uh, venture off this way and see what happens. Please don't be gassy. No, no gassy? Okay, so far so good. Oh, what is all that? Hmm. Clover? Strange black plants that look like clovers. to say clover field. Ah! <laughs> stranger! Stranger danger! Run, 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 run! Okay, uh, just because I wanted to go back to the first one, this is the first path we encounter, so let's... No power, just like the rest. Okay. Now we can go uh, talk to this giant person. At least relatively... Or comparatively giant. Hello! Giant robot friend! Uh oh. Yeah, yeah, play it down, play it down. Zing! That doesn't look like a kitten. So they are a cat person. I'm not just the only one that sees it. Perfect. Some sort of cat? I don't know, I thought their ears were attached to their hat, but I don't know. I don't even know anymore. Nuh uh. Oh, you're just a person? Huh. Yeah, that robot seems pretty convinced. Uh-oh. Yikes! Why would you think that would sound cold? Can you at least let us try? I see that sparkle. Look at that sparkle on the shelf. Yeah, we can't, uh... We're kind of locked in until 
we do what we need to do, I guess. Suppose with the light bulb or sun. I'm sorry, I can't imagine what you're feeling. It's been two weeks. I know it must be hard, but maybe it's better that you came back. It's only a matter of time before the robots are recalled. <gasps> they are little literal robots. At least let me know you got my message, okay? Kip. It's Kip. Please don't touch that. Backup power cell keeps me functional. See. Um. Screwdriver. Thanks. Can I screwdriver all the little broken glass bits out? Okay. Can I? <laughs> Oops. Interesting. Is this? Are these just light sources? of shrimp. Please don't make me. The top is covered with a wire mesh. Hmm. Making use of the light they have. I'm definitely not going to bed knowing what happens. Please don't make me play chess. Okay. Uh-oh. Please. Aw. That's too bad. There's that, there's that phraseology again. What does that mean? Photo to be a little glass. It's a little bit foggy to see details, though. How about now? I can't literally hold up the sun and see what's going on? That's unfortunate. She's gonna tell me. Okay. So those are some sort of power cells. Now that I know what that machine is, can I go back? To the other machine and try to puzzle together how to work it. Oh, I'm getting so far away. What is this? Oh dear. Oh dear. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Oh. Oh, okay. That's a that's a rope across a a hole. I thought that was like a dark rock that someone had wrapped something around. Okay. Oh. Hang on, I didn't necessarily, uh, 100% commit to going into the mines. A little gadget, like a camera. What? Pop that lens out. Boom. Pop that right in. Yeah! Peace out, I'm gonna go charge this battery. Oh, come on! Yeah, I guess so. I guess I am committed. It would be rude to leave now. Well, I didn't especially want to be here in the first place. I accidentally... I accidentally came down into the mines. Oh. Oh dear, oh dear. Do be careful. Eh. All right. That's too bad. A safety violation. I won't allow it. A huge network of underground mines is the source of this world's metal and non-phosphor fuel. This is what propelled the world into the industrial age, which will last forever. Oh dear, oh dear. The sun went out. The mines were abandoned. Well, not all cleared out. Some of them didn't find uh, new things to do. Oh, jeez. Maybe it was your own reflection from another time. Okay, but is that it? Yes, please. Yes, please. Gotta go charge this battery. Thank you for your sob story. It was very moving. Run, run, run. 
I think 291 are ha is half of that code, but I gotta figure out the other half. And in which order. But I mean, we just try it twice if it doesn't work the first time. Okay. Run, 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 run! What's that little machine? Back here in this building. Whoosh! Pardon me. Okay. Here we go. Profit bot is written on the side. Oh, that must be our friend. It's still empty. Oh, oh, oh. Oops. Do this. Still nothing. Dang. Oh. So that's the prop. No, so that's what keeping profit bot rolling around. Hey, what's going on? Functional, I can walk. You're welcome. Mm-hmm. How you doing? Sure did. Yeah. I mean, do you really need me to chime in there? Yeah. Woo. This would be a good time to save. Wow. Progress stops here. I believe we need a code to unlock a certain box. How do you... Uh oh They know what I've been up to. What? No longer exists in this world. Okay, now it's popping up things at me. Do you understand what this means, Rad? Does that mean it's hiding somewhere on my computer now? Because that would be crazy. Like, if I open up the one-shot di uh, directory or something, is there going to be a little... Like, in the readme? I'm legitimately weirded out right now. What's going on? Okay. So that code doesn't exist in the world of one-shot at, at this particular moment. That's terrifying. What does that mean? Did that only power uh, the robots in this building? Let me go check. Other buildings. Like... These were all mostly busted. Oh no! You guys are great. Hi! Hello there! That's it? Hi! Mmm. Well, they seem thrilled, at least. Hello there. Uh... So just that one metal crushing machine. Doing its business. Okie doke. Well, we at least made the rounds and said hi. Let's go find that one... Now, I don't know, because it's quite a long ways away. But maybe we can, uh... Talk to that one that's way over by our lady friend here. I am legitimately, I have no idea what that thing means about the code no longer existing in the world of one shot or this world or whatever, and then it being in my business afterwards, popping up little windows and whatnot. Yes! Hello, small person. Alright, I'll take it. <laughs> Welcome to Lookout Point. The old quarry. Head engineer. Wait, is that the lady? That they were, like, the uh, other journal entries were sort of complaining about? Maybe that was a case of, like, some sort of robophobia or something, but...
well, listen, I restored uh, power to some stuff, so I'm gonna go maybe check out the mine a little more. Maybe now that there's power, something good will happen. I don't know what, because this is still gonna be collapsed, isn't it? Safety violation. <laughs> Just from somewhere else, they bellowed out safety violation. Okay, so like they said, we need a vehicle to go further. Okay. Well, I mean, watching over the plants. Okay. Welcome, everybody, I guess. I mean, that's a good start. Localized power uh, rest restoration. Could be worse. Hmm. Hmm. Well, let me check all the buildings now. Because there are other robots, I think, that might be awake that I can have chats with. If nothing else, they might be happy to see a new and friendly face. Hi there! Everything might be fine, because apparently I'm the messiah and I have your son. And I don't mean like your progeny, I mean, you know, like literally uh, a celestial orb. Prophetbot, I'm going to come back to you later and see if you have any new questions. First though. Run, 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 run. Let's go back to all the buildings we were at before and see what power changes. Okay. Building number one. No change. Hello there! Okay. They seem, uh, again, they seem thrilled. <gasps> Maybe that robot will be working again. Now that I know that they're called robots. With a W. Hey, I'll check you out in a second. They're all rusty, though. I don't know if that'll... Definitely not going to bed. Did that already. Unexpected, but uh, ultimately satisfying. This, oh, yes, that's right. That's right. Can't go too far. Okay. They're all rusted over, though, is a problem. I remember that part. Yes, you're functional, but are you are you actually functional though? Could have been, could have been. Robot number three ten. Sure. Uh I don't think they have any like locations programmed in. Oh yeah, you're still really rusty. <laughs> oh, I can't just crowbar them a little bit? Okay, I have an empty bottle. What can I scoop into that bottle? And then we can pour on this robot. Hmm. It's gotta be like oil or something somewhere. I can't interact with any of these pools, I don't think. Plus, this is just, you know, twinkly water or something. I don't even know. Private bot, where do you keep your oil? Private bot, I have questions for you. I hope so. I hope you have new ones. Draft. Tell me about the barons again. Boop, 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 boop. But speedily this time. I'm so sorry to ask you about your friends. Yes, that you do not have, nor desire. All right, engineer lady. Maybe she's got something that can help me. Run, 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 run. It's like the running back and forth is just going to get longer and longer as I progress. Not that I'm complaining. Run, 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 run. Also, who laid these tracks? What's going on there? Is that some, an example of the engineer's work? Is that the quality of craftsmanship we can expect? I remember seeing 291. This isn't going to work at all. And then he was robot, robot 310. 
Dang. <laughs> That's all I was going for. I hope to trick it. <laughs> I know that's not possible, but I was hoping. Okay, so I can go in this direction only because it doesn't have spooky gas. Spooky gas is elsewhere if I start going too far north. If I go, if I continue east, there's just the mines. So, grease me up, woman! I mean, uh, help me find some way to lubricate the joints of this uh, robot I'm, I'm attempting to... Yes, I do! No, 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 no! What are you lying to them for? Sigh. Okay, well... 420-420? Could be. Or like 420-24-7? Yes, you are certainly watching over those plants. All right, where do I find... Maybe I'll go back to the, um... The factory with all the busted up bits. And then... One of them might be able to... I don't want to read the suicide note again. <laughs> I will, I will. Jeepers! I don't know who that was. I hope it's not the lady or the person that, um... The engineer there pines for. way out. Taking the long road out. That doesn't help me. That takes me back to the box I can't open. Okay. The engineer lady is of no further help. I think it's a lady. Could be wrong. Back to the factory. Do it. Can I scoop up any of your juices? Yeah, it's badly damaged. Is it leaking oil, perhaps? Mm-hmm. But again. I'm just hoping... Yep. Bits. Bits are fine. I, yeah, it doesn't, uh, it doesn't bother me at all if it's badly damaged. If it's leaking some sort of, like, fluid, though, can we go ahead and add a little bit of that to my sweet glass bottle? Well, that's a total strikeout on this end. Sheesh. What about all this machinery? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Run, run, run. Okay. What's up, Brubba Bot? Just hopping from building to building at this point. Pardon me. Anything else in here that can help me? Still has some shards of glass at the bottom, though. Well, that can't be of any use, I don't think. So you guys are just chilling. Just happy to be back. There's nothing wrong with that. Every time I talk to the computer, it d addresses me directly, and that's spooky. Everything here seems to be as it should. But I don't really know... where else to go. I can head back here, but there's nothing in the first building or the second building anymore, other than that place to go to sleep, and we know I'm not doing that again. Because <laughs> I know it'll save when I quit, so I'll just wait until I'm done playing to save my progress. Because I'll definitely be coming back, despite the uh, difficult beginning. I'm quite enjoying my one shot to save everybody. What about these pools? What are you filled with? Not the large ones, but the little tiny ones. Are you like... Magical robot juice. I'm looking for robot juice, please, but I can't go any further north than this because it gets a spooky place with the gases that I can't breathe. Here, there's just that bed that haunts me. Hmm. Okay. We've been 
pretty good so far about combining everything we find. But I've not had much luck finding any, anything other than what's already in our inventory, which is our sun, of course. The empty bottle, which I'm assuming we need to fill with something that we then pour over that robot that then, like, lubricates its joints and helps us move. I don't even know if that's real or not, but that's just an assumption I'm making. And then the crowbar that we've already used to pry open that other fancy case. I feel like the next thing we need to do is open that six-digit coded box, but the cryptic message about the code for it no longer existing in one shot presented to me as a pop-up on my desktop. Uh, I'm just looking. Like, I don't see anything that's gonna tell me. Like, I was expecting maybe a file or something to be generated in my C drive that I just look at, and it's like, boo! Here's the passcode! Isn't it spooky that I put this on your computer? And yes, quite frankly, that is a little unnerving. But... I don't, uh... I don't know where to go... <laughs> to find that. It is a very interesting clue, isn't it? That I'm just not picking up on. I think I'm, like, in the right direction where thinking it has something to do with my own computer, but... Where on earth would it be? I've already checked the one-shot directory. I've already checked, like, the... my system directories and stuff. I don't even know if that's real. Like, or if it's just gonna, like... taunt me with that, and then I start looking everywhere. You know what I mean? If it's one of those things. Just to put me on edge. And hey, listen. For the sake of me progressing in the game... <laughs> If you happen to know, don't hesitate to tell me. Every once in a while, I will need a hint. I'm booting the butt to keep going. So I am stuck. I definitely need to lubricate that robot. <laughs> Something goes in that bottle eventually. At the moment, though, the only piece... Like I said, the only thing that I know to be working on or that they made mention of in-game... here. Every other area I know to go to so far is spooky ass, though. If I go too far north, it's just spooky ass. This is going to be the 291 thing again? Yes. I do need to find more pieces of paper. They seem to be very useful. I concur. But like, can't go any further north than this, because there are the spooky gas emitters, and that way just whoops around. to the left here, which was just awful to read. I think those are the only two. 
available on this screen. Now, the overworld. Okay, let me loop around to check. Yeah, that's that's the suicide note. That's a dead end. That's a big loop around. It takes me back down to where I could potentially input that code. Yeah, gas masks. This is the one about the gas masks that taught me that. So I have examined all of the ones on the world there. I don't mind it if it wants me to be slow and methodical. I got no problem with any of that. But I thought I had already exhausted. Now we're going to pour over every little itty bitty square of this map. Okay, I can't really get behind it there. But if there's anything on the wall of the factory that can help me. No? Hello. Not on this floor at any rate. Doot 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 doot. Not here either. Not even a memo saying, hey! I gotta go back to the computer, do I? But it's mean to me. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for being direct. I mean, I would have made it there eventually. As it is the next building. You again. It is contained within a document. The document has found a place that belongs outside the game. Oh, are you serious? I have to go into my documents? Oh my goodness gracious me. There's a text file in my documents folder. Well, that's terrifying. I mean, I understand their inclusion in the game. Wow. I just can't, uh, unfortunately can't share that with the viewer. Other than you get to hear my amazement. <laughs> Wowzers. I was not expecting this at all. And all of this is just sort of lost on you if you do full screen, or is it just means that they don't really want you, like, tabbing back and forth to try to look stuff up? That's so weird. So is this from an entirely different... Oops. What do I need the gas mask memo for? Is this from an entirely different person than the malicious voice in the computer? Because why would they then help me? Or are they obscuring messages that would be in this one-shot universe? that, um, I'm just, yeah, I'm confused more than anything else, but that's, that's nothing new. That was the code they gave me. Uh, don't worry about it. Yeah, I had some help. Don't worry about it. Aha! A gas mask. Okay, a book in a weird language. Whoa! And then we ripped a hole in space-time. Yeah, it's cool. I just wish, uh... I wish I'd known that more of that going in. I would have tried to find a way to prepare to... Uh, highlight other elements. Like the outside stuff. Like, if I had known text uh, files would be incoming, for example, maybe I could find out a way to, like, window them on top of the gameplay. But anyway, we'll figure it out from there. That's just sort of hanging out in the middle of the world now? Oh, I'll wear it when I have to. Okay. Strange journal with a clover on it. I see. That's a clue right there. Let's go check out those who watch over the plants. But first I want to see if I can get closer to this. Nothing? I don't have a stick to poke at it with anymore. What if I use a little light bulb on it? Pew, 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 pew. Nothing. Okay, strange journal. Yes, yes. 
forgot. I didn't mean to combine it. I just want to try. Hi there, is this yours? Huh. Is it. had something to do with. That's why I brought it. I went to this area because of the insignia more than anything else. Okay, perfect. All right, I will absolutely hold on to it for now. It will be important later. Sounds great. Now though, I'm gonna go ahead and check out these sp spooky gas areas I can do that I could not previously do, starting with this one. go to the other easterly one. Unless I can work my way there from here. Oh, look at your cute little gaze mask. Let's see. Oh, look how cute. Very sweet holding your little son. All right, what are these? Oh, just fallen buildings. Yeah. Oof, spooky guys. Gas vents. They're all lit up, too. Oof. Oh, here we go. Hi there. I'm gonna grab the shiny. A pair of heavy rubber gloves. Okay. Hi, stop moving. Stop moving so I can talk to you. Hey, hey, hey. Hi. The old chemical processing plant. Most of the equipment has already been relocated. Most of the equipment, not all. Hi there. Eh, eh, oh. Come here, you little rascal. I'm trying to talk to you. The robot assembly and repair services have been discontinued at the Barrens. No, no wonder it's terrible out here. Further inquiry, please contact the head engineer. Oh, I've, uh, I've already chatted with her. She's a delight. Seems like a page ripped out of a book. Cannot overstate the importance of cleaning solvents in this environment. Here is a simple recipe using the alternative method discussed in the last chapter, utilizing the natural properties of blue phosphor. Reagents, acidic gas, and rare form blue phosphor. In a well-ventilated area, direct the gas into your container of choice. Seal immediately. Okay. Well, I know what I'm going to do here. Oh, rubber gloves I will put on as needed, too. Hot diggity! Crowbar, so handy. <laughs> okay, let's go. Whoa! Cybermen. Something about a bunch of robots standing up like that. Okay. Let me grab the shiny first. A cleaning sponge with a rough surface. Well, maybe I can just scrub the rust off the other guy. Maybe I need to combine it with something, though. Like a sponge and a crowbar. <laughs> anyway. What do you have to say for yourself? Two, without breaking the seal, inject the liquid phosphor into the container. This is after you put the gas in it. Shake vigorously and initiate the reaction. Use as soon as possible. If the elements begin to separate, further shaking is required. Hand protection is critical after the step. Good thing we have gloves. The resulting acid is moderately stronger than common household cleaners. Well, there you go. I just have to build this. I gotta get some acid and some blue phosphor and then shake it up in my bottle and use it as a cleaning solution with the sponge because it's slightly more acidic than normal household cleaner, right? So that should dissolve the acid, but leave the robot okay. Slowly but surely, we gotta figure out how to start using all this stuff. That sounds right. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's a lot of info. That's a big info dump. That's something. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> Love the instant gas mask. All right. Oh, another paper just strewn about. 
There's something weird about the robots who get sent to work near the gas fields. They appear to accumulate rust at a much slower rate than the others. A few who work directly with gas harvesting look practically new. Is this a result of the atmosphere? Or am I, or am I just seeing things? Interesting. Whoop. Oh, maybe we're headed to the other... Oh, I don't know where I am. <gasps> Enormous. Hi there. Do I gotta build you an arm? Gladly. Should have evacuated this place long ago. We've just arrived. Mm. Oh, the Messiah. Neat. Greeting was not part of my programming. But being confused about what to do apparently was. Absolutely, we're old friends with ProfitBot. With the sole purpose of greeting you. Why is it not greeting bot? Really? That's, yeah, I was gonna say, that's kind of a bummer. So they just kind of chill out and literally just wait for Nico and no one else. Ah. I've not been tamed. People keep saying that. People keep saying that. I don't know what that means. Oh, so many papers. Apparently, phase one of the evacuation ended prematurely. The big ship started malfunctioning only after a few round trips. They said it was due to something with squares. I'm not sure what they meant by that. Bummer. Looks like they won't be able to transfer most of these surplus bots to the city at this rate. And we worked so hard on those, but I suppose the robots are busy enough with transporting people as is. I think it's going to be our turn soon. Uh-oh. Something tells me it was not their turn soon. Looks like they're evacuating the few tamed robots we have here. Makes sense. No point in keeping them in the barrens if all the people are already gone. I wonder if the engineer is going too. Nope. They remained. This is probably the security bot's battery. Our power cell. Guardian of residential area. Yep. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, can you... Oh, I don't really have a reason... Scared of ladders, okay. Don't we have a reason to go up there at this rate anyway? So, whoa! Hi! Unit RM288-3417 reporting for duty. I saw that you spoke with the Guardian of the Settlement. I will now escort you until you reach your dormitory. Are you just gonna hang around? Is this the dormitory? I relieve you of your duties. Whoops! on this page is faded too. So many faded pages. Likely due to some sort of electrical or magnetic interference, I'm afraid this operation can no longer be sustained. If the service continue to fail, so much that maintenance cannot keep up the pace. Fortunately, it does not seem to be happening to the robots, at least not at a significant rate. Time will tell. It will indeed. Hi there. None of them boots. Not sure what to do now. Astute observation, Nico. Hi there. Terminals are on spawn. This is a problem. Yes. That is indeed a problem. Okay, I'm not at my dormitory. Please don't freak out or anything. And another residential block? I remember being taught in school about how the waters surrounding the forest stretch until the boundaries of space, but at some point the prehistoric oceans receded, forming what is now the Barrens. I wonder where all that water went. I guess, uh, concentrated toward the center of the city where the tower is. If I had to just take a swing there, I would guess the elite of your society somehow have all the water they could possibly want. I like that I have a look up the ladder button. <laughs> look up a ladder and get scared button. Okay. Isn't the sun getting heavy by now? Wow, this thing just keeps going. More residential areas. Picture of a robot. I've never been around so many robots before, Rad. Or any robots. <laughs> yeah, I see my cartoons all the time, too. Do a robot voice? I don't need her to do that. They're just neat, though. Hey, there's a robot up there. Talk to them. Stationed. Uh, for what purpose? Hang on. Let us continue this conversation. Oh. 
That's it. I was hoping to investigate further, but that's okay. Perhaps later. Man, oh man. These all housed people, or were these all quote-unquote tamed robots? Yeah? Okay. Okay. I think when you just talk to them in the outworld, they start escorting you, and then they stop when you go inside and come back out. They seem to be a little out of it. Looks like we're supposed to pack stuff for the evacuation starting today. I wish these books weren't so heavy. It's going to be a pain to carry them onto the ship. All this advanced technology, they don't have, like, e-readers? But they're by the author. I can't just throw them away. The author of the prophecy, perhaps. Hey, sweetie, six more weeks until you come home. Ha about time, huh? Gosh, I can't imagine living that awful capsule wall dorm thing. But guess what? Soon you'll, be, you'll get to sleep in a real bed and eat real food again. Right back soon. Love, Mom. Aw, okay, so they were stationed here for whatever reason, maybe to terraform the planet? For, yes, 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 I'm just checking all up all the ladders since we have robot friends up some of them. I also can't remember what direction I need to be going. Whoa! Oh, the infirmary, that's new. Okay, there's so many escort bots just chilling. Some sort of mechanical drawing. Evacuation at such short notice? I can't believe this. First the sun dies, now I'm out of a job. I mean, everyone feels things differently. Nope, nobody up here. Gee, I hope I'm not supposed to be, like, looking up this way in case there's people in, like, the top right corner like that robot would be in the, hanging near the ladder. Whoop! Too far, too far! I want to go back! I want to go back! Well, that might be the connective tissue between the two spooky gas areas. Okay, I did not get into the infirmary before, excuse me. I would like to go check that out. Maybe they have some goop. Do you have goop that I can use to help rust, or do you have some sort of acid or phosphor or anything like that? Hello, person of organic makeup! Welcome to the infirmary! Hey! Plastic syringe, huh? That's what we can use to put something into something else. Like, we put use the syringe on the empty bottle after we do the gassy stuff? I wonder if I can use the empty bottle on one of the gas vents, and then I just need to get something into the syringe, jam it into the bottle, and then shake, shake, shake. Hello, person! No, I don't want to go in here, no. Okay. Let me go to a gas vent with the, the bottle up and see if that makes a difference. Hi. I'm assuming I'm going to cork it right away. A lot of people tell me to put a cork in it all the time, so... Vent. Oh! Dang! Can't reach the top! How do we get a short one? Or how do we... Man... Is there one short one? <laughs> or do we have to find a way to extend... The bottle? This is so fun. All right. These ones aren't even... I feel like these used to be gas vents and they just dried up or whatever. Okay, let me go to the other, all the way to the other side. Pass all this. Wowzers, look at all this. This keeps going. I would like a stout gas vent, please, if you happen to have one to spare. Stouter the better. Or do we get our giant friend to help us somehow? Hey, can you reach the top of one of these gas vents for us? Okay. 
Oh, you can't leave, huh? Hmm. Yes. Yes, my assigned escort. However did I survive without you? Infirmary. Thank you very much for your assistance. You're most helpful in the infirmary. Excuse me. Let me just scoot by you here. Let me try the other side of the spooky gas area. Let's see if I have better success here. Assuming as I am that this comes out above the easterly portion that I had already visited. All pools. No vents that I can make out. squat. Not a squat ski amongst you. Okay, that's definitely where I come up by the robot. Which we're definitely making progress toward fixing. I betcha. I betcha. Oh! Absolutely! Oh, oh. Uh-huh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's okay. A funnel or something? How about? And this is just crazy. How about a syringe? The liquid might be a bit too thick to fit in the needle. Okay, so that half is done. I have a filled syringe that I need to get gas in the... Oh, hello. The sky is dark. The sun will be back up. We're working on it. That's right. See, look, it's right here in the hand. See? Don't fret. Brighter days ahead. Quite literally. Alright, so I was meant to come all the way here for that bubble, which is great. Now, how do I get how do I get the gas into the glass bottle in the first place that I can then inject inject with these? Oh, there we go. Yes, please. Okay. Initially, the amount of noxious fumes emitted by the natural gas vents caught our team off guard. Thank goodness the medical team reacted as quickly as they did. Despite its failure, that first expedition did bring up some interesting observations about the barrens. We found that it's not one, but two such vent zones. With fumes being pumped out in such high concentrations, it seems a miracle that the gas hasn't spread anywhere else. Our biologists concluded that the phosphor shrimp in the crater pools are actively consuming the gas. The shrimp in the ocean also prevent the gas from wafting off into the glen. If that's the case, then we owe a lot to these little guys. Yay, shrimps! Thank you for your contribution. Is that them all sparkling all in the pools and stuff? Thank you, shrimpy friends. Shrimps. Okay, so we have those two elements. I'm going to run back to the robot first before I start combining things. They're down here. Run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. I don't know why they give me the option of a run button when you know as soon as I have the option, you know I'm going to do it. Why would I just walk everywhere? If you have to do so much traveling, why wouldn't it just be set to auto run? Anyway. Okay. Going back to this robot. Here we go. We take our bottle of smoke with our filled syringe. Yes. It's like I'm a doctor. Shake it up. Bottle of acid. With the sponge. Yes, indeed. Wet sponge with our friend right here. I have no other choice than to hold still. Well, hopefully you'll have some options in a moment. Yay! Now get to work! I mean, that sounded mean, but they're literally programmed to it. And as, as I said, fulfill their purpose. <laughs> so, not straight to the tower, I'm sure, but probably to the next area. Yeah, we're going to the glen, and then we got to make our way to the sanctuary, or whatever it was called. And then we can get to the tower. Oh dear. It is not good at all. Your navigation circuit's fried. 
What if uh, you, Ro, and I, I like look in the direction we're going, can sort of call out left or right, <laughs> or whatever it is. Head engineer, gotcha. I'm gonna go into the non-spooky gas route. I don't know if it's. Uh, I don't know if it takes longer, but whatever. It's the non-spooky gas route. And I'm committed to it, so here we go. Run, 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 run! We're gonna build you a bicycle or something. That would be amazing. Get a little bike built. What's up, Private Bot? Keeping it real. Oh, oh, I can't go around that. I've tried already. Do, 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 do. Love the crook prints. Love the footstep sound. So crunchy. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Alright. Almost there. Uppity, uppity, uppity. Over here. <laughs> this is wise. We really need public transportation in the barrens. Hi, kid. There's no one here alive to use it. All the robots just seem to wander around like back and forth. Hi, head engineer lady. Mm -hmm. Some sort of navigational issue. Yes. Yep, apparently that's it. Yeah, we were all over it. Something that may help. Oh, goody, goody, goody. Robots have the ability to trace material from their source locations. If you let the robot borrow this, then its backup tracking system should activate. Whoa! Fancy Clover Medallion. It is a very pretty necklace. Amber from the Glen. Hot diggity. Black Clover. It's also dot dot dot. They didn't account for feelings in your programming, though somehow you developed them, which is great. Never mind. Engineer's been through some stuff. Bye. Oh, nice, nice person, Nico. Yeah, anything we can do for you? Oh, the one thing I didn't want to do. Sure. Please don't make me actually do this. Oh, good. We'll just get beat a chest. Moshi, thanks very much for hanging out. You're welcome anytime. Appreciate you, uh, lending your support to my silly little stream. Built into the code to be really good at chess. Yeah, that's all. You're the one that seems to be affected by uh, emotions to a degree. Yeah, tamed. There's that term again. Watch out, boy, she'll tame you up. Taming is complicated. Tell me, why's it got to be so complicated? <laughs> there goes my other bishop. I can't really explain what tame robots are. But I'm one of them. Is that... Does that make you more... Human in a way? Is that where we're getting at? There goes my little horse. Oh, poor Nico. Have we been anywhere else? Oh. Why don't you come... Hang on, why don't we just get another boat, and why don't you row us there if you already know all the places to go and stuff? Clearly there's nothing holding you here but melancholy. Yeah, so we shouldn't even try. I mean, just because you're holding this thing in your hand and it's clearly like a mechanical sun that would make perfect sense in a world of robots, meh. Don't you dare, silly Nico's good intentions. 
We are absolutely going to save this place, and that includes restoring the sun. No, you're still here, buddy. Or if you weren't before, you're back now. Maybe I was back. Or maybe I was gone, I should say. Aww. It wasn't that long ago. You may have missed her, though. Check me! Okay, sad lady. Uh. Yes, that uh, that emoji was the last thing we saw to you after you gave me that hint. After commenting on how hyped the game is. You got me unstuck. Alright, I think this might actually be quicker to go. I mean, once I remember the, the way. I think it might be quicker to go this way. Uh. Oh, dearie me. Pass the infirmary. That's where we learned all about our acids and stuff in the first place. Oh, I didn't know these were labeled before. 118. It's very bleak, is the color palette, when you're not near Nico and the, the tiny sun they carry. Oh, sorry about that, SSC Ninja. Yeah, as long as the void didn't talk or stare back, you're okay. Alright, now we just go down from here, and we can get to the, uh, 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 please, 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 I have, uh, uh, I have amber that must be delivered. Here, jam this into your circuitry, and it will somehow, uh, work. Jam it into your circuitry, it'll somehow work a tree. Ta. Ellipses. Big brain. Oh, that's nice of you. I played a few point-and-click adventures in my time that feature combining stuff in your inventory. Mm hmm. Over capacity. Okay. I assume that just means we successfully navigated the Barons. Look how cute those eyes. Every time it cuts to, like, full-screen stuff. Looks great. Aww. Uh, you a little nervous going over the water, kitty? I mean, human, that's definitely not a cat. Act 2. The Glen. Thanks. Wait. Hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Are you not to ferry people to and from the Glen? Like, how do I... How do I get back? I mean, I don't need to, but in the times when people were using this to go back and forth, would you just leave them here? That seems questionable as a robot. Anyway, what am I walking for? I don't know why we just don't auto-run. Whoa! What a beautiful view. Oh, the squares look beautiful this time of night. Okay. Whoa! Going all over the place. Ah, alright. Around and down. Whoa! Marvin the Martian? Oh dear, oh dear! What's happening? Hi there. Do I have to help you thwart duck dodgers? What's going on? Hey! Hey! There! 
Oh, catching fireflies for mommy. All right, I'll get out of the way then. It's so chill. Look at all these fun fireflies and stuff all over the place. Black clover certainly is abundant here too. Nice clean water. Is that what this all is? Whoa! Hey there! No fish biting today? Seemed pretty chill for a stranger just rolling up in your town. Hey! I like all your style though. Due to flooding, most of us moved to less permanent settlements. Land has gotten brittle. A bunch of islands that get smaller and smaller. So that you have an abundance of water in the glen? Shove that stuff to the barrens, yo! Let's get an irrigation system going. We can solve these problems. Fireflies here and not phosphor shrimp. I like how all the insects and other sort of primitive life forms take full advantage of the mysterious element known as phosphor. Okay, that's the town to the north. Let's go check that out later. Oof. <laughs> nice. I totally understood that reference. I'd like to make myself believe. Whoa! Sorry, that scared the crap out of me. Alula! Alula, where did you go? This person has four eyes at least. Yeah, I heard it. it scared the crap out of me, like I said. Southeast of here. Oh, whoa! Spooky light up trees, huh? Southeast. Hi there! Oh, there you go. Do you just naturally have four eyes? That's cool. Yes! She was, uh, uh, she was catching fireflies. I didn't mind, uh, I don't know, whatever butterflies and stuff, whatever album of that, like, number-wise. I had, there was no shame in enjoying that. It's fun, poppy music. There's nothing wrong with that at all. Knowing that he wrote it through Bouts of Insomnia and stuff is actually pretty impressive. I've not investigated them any, them any further than that, though. Little sister! A little shorter. Blue hair. Two blue feathers on top of her head. Yeah, I thought that was the, uh, the little girl or little boy catching fireflies for their mommy, but that's not... That does not match their description at all. They're all, like, pink or red or something. Back inside the ruins... Hang on, hang on, hang on. The ruins where? Like where I was? Near the town? You're just chilling in the forest waiting for her to get back. Where would that be? Back from where? Oh. Oh. Bridges are good. Bridges are good. I think. I hope. I wonder. Hey, robots again. Hello there. The research station. Uh, is that silver? Is that the silver? Uh, previously mentioned? Hello there. No. Yeah, she's with me. Or they're with me. I don't know if it's a boy or a girl. It's Nico. They're with me and I'm with them. Whoa, red bat. Red bat, red bat, red bat. I'm only here to pick up this week's moss samples. I will return to my station in the city soon. By the way, in chat, RTMS, have you heard uh, DJ Cumberbun's mashup of, uh, I believe it's called Basket Flies of Green Day and L City? Pretty good. Pretty good stuff. The moss samples. 
Oh, you should, you should definitely check it out. They do the first half with the music of one and the lyrics of the other, and then halfway through, brilliantly, they switch. Oh, it's it's nice, it's really nicely done. Big fan of DJ Cumberbund on there on YouTube. Main generator of the whole Glen. Yeah. Does not need to be fixed. Cool, cool, cool. Let me just check it out anyway. Neat. Congrats. Oh yeah, I didn't double check my inventory. So I still have the amber, which helps us. The strange journal. So we still have to figure out what language this is. And of course we have our tiny sun. Our precious sun. Oh, these are phosphor trees. Oh. Well then what do they mine then? If phosphor is like the prime prime uh, prime element and uh it just grows on trees. What are the mines for? Or are these trees that survive on phosphor and don't actually produce it? Thank you. Ah, I was hoping for more information. I was hoping to talk myself into some more lore. Please, robot friends. <gasps> yes, tell me about these weird ano anomalies. Do 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 do. Anomaly. Do 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 do. Anomaly. Do 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 do. What the heck is it? Well, that doesn't help me. Beep boop, water collection project resuming. <laughs> Hello, living person. I've collected a duplicate water sample. Would you like it? Absolutely. Yes. Cool. Water samples. Okay, okay. A little tube of water that says water sample. Thank you. Um, <laughs> anomaly phone, nice. Right? Now I have a water sample. Who? Okay. Cool. Collect those moss samples. <laughs> what if I did this? What if I ruined it? Oh, <laughs> what if I poured water on their generator and shut it all down? <laughs> Never mind, that would be terrible. Oh, that's nice. Just programming pleasant to people. Yeah, obviously we're going a little later because we had uh, some issues with starting this thing on time. Took three cracks at it because the first time we started I hadn't opened the desktop audio or microphone audio so I did my intro and booted the game up and there would have been no accompanying sound and then uh, we started playing the game with sound and I thought I did try to put the sun in the metal press maybe I didn't um, I didn't get this through steam though so it might not it might not have any achievements linked to it full of eels Snakes. Oh, snakes. Instead of eels. Nico yells at you. That's cool. Anyway, the second time I try to boot this thing up, it works successfully, obviously, but when it gets to the part that it starts literally naming the person playing, it was using my name and not, you know, my numb diploma here of Rad Gnarly. So I had to take a few stabs at uh, fixing that, which included rebooting my computer. Hi there. Father left the village when you're still young. Lived in the ruins ever since. Oh, just Alula and I. Oh yeah, the little girl. Blue feathers in her hair. Hmm. So you're definitely not the right person. But you're the only little kid I've run into here. So I haven't checked out the town. These are supposedly the ruins still. Oof. Fill with small dried fish. Fish heads, fish heads. Roly poly fish heads? Fish heads, fish heads. Eat them up yum. I don't remember her yelling at me about uh, putting the sun in the machine, so maybe not.
I feel like that's something I would have remembered and glommed onto. It's an interesting moment. Okay, haven't gone to the village prior, so let's take our first peeky peek. Full of milk! Milk makes you grow taller! That's what Mom always says. That's nice. Whoa, I didn't know I could ring all the bells. Cute. We got lots of jars of stuff. Big fans of jars. Peas, a jar of peas. Sure. All right. If I can't go into all these houses, I'm not going to like root through all your jars. I am at least going to talk to everyone I see. Hi there, you have blue on you. Are you that person? Most of the green moss covering our village has already lost its glow. If it wasn't for the thin strip left on the boundaries of the land, people could easily fall off into the ocean. Oh, this is glowing moss here bobbing in the water. Okay. Oh, look how it changes. Grass noise, gravel noise, grass noise, gravel noise. Oh, here's a building I can enter. Hi there, what's on, what's, uh, what's cooking? Oh, you don't know if I'm the savior yet. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, phew. After that one time, I am super paranoid now of all the beds in this game. They're just gonna shut down my uh, my experience here. Whoa! Just spinning, just spinning. I'm helping. We're doing it together. Okay. You're gonna get dizzy. Oh, there the tower. The tower rotates. Used to spin all the time, bringing sunlight to the world. Is it a lighthouse? Urgh. That's fun. Hello there. Man, I like your clothes here. Squares. Oh, those weird things. Squares, man, they're bad news. Those weird anomalies in the in the middle of the ocean or whatever. Hello, little sheepy sheeps. Uh, uh, yeah, goats or whatnot. No sun, no crops. Yikes. No pressure. Please hurry. We're dying. Hey, Shepard. I hurt. Hey, wait a minute. You're a perfectly normal human being. Who are you? Uh. What? Come back when your hands are free. You mean, like, after I beat the game, I can come back and push rams around? That's weird. Oh, maybe I'm also supposed to get access to these wonderful... Uh... Jars. Of who knows what. Heretofore, unknown delights. Hi there. What do you got going on? Hey, wait a minute. You got a bunch of blue on you, are you not? Uh, no. No, none of the stuff that we have is uh, available for trade. I mean, we could try the tube of water. Oh. Oh. Okay, well, I don't want to offer you anything else because it's all too important to me. I'm still looking for that other little friendo somewhere. Ooh, what do we have in here? A pair of shoes and some jewelry. Some kind of cloak or shawl folded neatly. An orb made out of amber. And a staff. Yeah, the one the profit bot was holding. Okay. Huh. Yeah, I wonder what I put on the altar there. The water sample. It would have worked already had it, uh, had that been the answer? Whoa, so many weird squares. Oh, hello. The flood can take away our farmlands, but it can't take away our fish! Or your ability to fish. Mm -hmm. All right. 
Alright, well that's a whole lot of just that person fishing. Trader. Ooh, spookums. Vines. What can I do with vines? Nothing at the moment. Nothing at all. Eh, uh. Hmm. That's definitely something important later. If only I had some sort of weed whacker or shepherd's crook or some... Spin, spin, spin. Whoa! Excuse me? That's just... That's just wrong. <laughs> Terrifying. Goodness gracious me. Why would you put that in this game? Fragmenting at an alarming rate. I don't like to think about the day when this town finally loses to the intruding sea. We'll have to find another place to settle. If you're gonna party, you better party hard. Okay, well, I was in here. Yeah, I talked to them about their delicious stew. Oh, unattended stew. Can I not just have some? Coals, stew, fireflies lighting up the room. You're just gonna not... I mean, it's very noble of you not to... Not to uh, take other people's stuff, but... That's kind of what I'm trying here. Maybe... Not really, yeah. It's nice and warm. It's kind of cozy, actually. Whoa! Do you have too much stuff? The last of our grain surpluses. Now we're dealing with a vermin problem. Why do you deny your catness? Embrace your feline heritage. Did I talk to you already? It's slowly being chipped away already, but it's still trying to stay alive, I think. Doesn't matter. One day the world will finally give up this fight. I just hope I'm not alive to see it. I'm <laughs> bringing back the sun, though. Won't that be the, uh... Yeah. Okay. I mean... Everyone's kind of a bummer. Oh! Eh! 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 No! Eh! All right, guess not that one. What about this one? I don't think I can get down. Oh, I can. Hello! Daddy says the world's very sick, but Rad can make it better again. Hang on! How do they know about me? Aw, thanks. It is pretty neat talking to you. Just a jar. When is the door not a door? When it's a jar. Do I sleep here and have another funky dream? No. Where it shuts the game down and freaks me out? Okay. Well, we've spoken to a lot of folk in and around the town. We're never speaking to that thing again. I could have sworn this was going to be that lost kiddo because of the blue in their hair and they're the only person with blue. Mind you, they wouldn't be like full grown and stuff, I guess, or operating side hustle. Or maybe that's just like what they want their uh, sibling to think that they're all sweet and innocent where they've been working the side hustle for a while. But anyway, turned out not to be them. Oh, you're new. The light from these lanterns will do for now. I'm starting to see some very small sprouts. Probably take some time for these to bear fruit. Crush, crush, crush. I destroy them. Oops. I have been stepping on them though. Ah! I didn't know that would actually factor in. I was just teasing. I was just teasing. Okay, so that's kind of all the villagey bits for now. It's okay, it's okay. It turned out that I avoided them. They all seem uncrushed. And so far as I can tell. Fish population near the village are thinning, so we fisher folk are making temporary shelter here. Kids coming in and out of the ruins. Oh, 
on now. Like down here, here? Or no, this is the forest. Like to the east here? I can't go any further east. Can I? No. So it's gotta be down in the forest then. Yeah. Follow the road. Follow the road. Until there is no road. Okay, phosphor plants or trees or whatever. Hi there. Nice. Congrats. Snakes. Oh, okay. <laughs> they were eels. Thought they were eels at first, but they're just catching water snakes. Okay. I mean, we've definitely covered this ground before, I would assume. But we're going to try to find this little kiddo so we can do something good before we call it a night. Hello. Little blue-haired person. We are looking through every nook and cranny for you. Alright, I don't want to disturb your water collection process. That would be rude. Whoa. What's that? I don't know why I assume everyone's here to hurt me. Full of vines again, huh? We need a way to bust those vines. Maybe this guy can help us with their giant cricket bat. Hi, I'm going to talk to you in a second. How come you defendery types only have seem to have one arm, unless it's perfectly blending in with the wall there? Be back in a jiff, just looking at every other conceivable... What? No comment on these strange hieroglyphs or cave paintings? Hello there! Partially flooded ruins! Maybe we shouldn't be here. There's no immediate danger. You see this area as a dwelling is not recommended, though. Okay, well. Reasonable. Partially flooded. So we'll go down until we can't go down anymore. Try to find that kiddo. Hello! And a way to trap down these vines. Yeah. Maybe we should have talked to the big boy outside first. Hello. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Uh-oh. Here we go again. Please don't be mean to me, computer. Uh, it just changed my Windows uh, backdrop. Seems you need help again. Nico will not be able to progress otherwise. This time the information you need has fallen to the most easily accessible place on your machine. I absolutely see it. Whoa. So it changed my desktop background to be a, uh, an image that I think will come into play if I run into some sort of security measure. But uh, I don't know yet, but I have a feeling it will be soon. Mere minutes ago? Yeah, I thought that had been, like, growing over for ages. A sign that the Glen itself is in distress? What? A living being is in need of help, but I cannot trace the source. Okay, if it dispatched, like, someone to my place of residence, that's too far, one shot. I'm just teasing. They wouldn't, they wouldn't do that. It's not that type of game. Hello. What do you have to say for yourself? Hello, person again. Two children reside near here. Oh, maybe to this side. Hello? Pathway is blocked by blocks. Odd that they're so effective. Do you think they, Nico would be able to just step over it? I mean, it freaked me out too because I'm playing in, in windowed mode, even on a single monitor. As I have now completely minimized OBS in order to take a look at this weird wallpaper here. Otherwise, I wouldn't have noticed right away. Hello? Yeah, I gotta, I gotta check every corner. That's just how I am. Run through this big old hallway. Whoa! Whoa! Find Central! Who are you? 
Are you doing okay? No, 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 no. The sun, I haven't seen it, I haven't felt it. Here, hold this, hold this thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Should I trust this person? I mean, I don't really have a choice. Let's just do it. <sighs> Everything in my gut tells me not to do this because of course she's gonna turn into a giant monster, but then it's an adventure game and I have no way to actually like fight. So I don't think that's gonna happen. Let's just, here you go. Warm. There you go. that one bit. I don't like that one bit. Where are them vines? Get him out of here. Whoa! Teleportacion. Okay. There's that one. There was one way up close to the, uh, where I came in, though. Here. Hello? Small children that shouldn't be down here? What? Oh, I think I know what's going on here. Okay, how many across is that? <laughs> boop, boop, boop. As I refer to my wallpaper, this is pretty neat. Two, three. Two, three. Do, do, do. And then how do I finish the sucker off? Whoa. There you go. That was the pattern in the middle of this wallpaper. Ah! Save them. Hi there. Oh, this is the person I was looking for. Oh, good, oh, good, oh, good. Okay. Update on my wallpaper. Um, it didn't change it back so much as just looks to have replaced it with a zoomed-in version of the same image. Yeah, Lula. Been looking for you. Calamus. That's a fun name, too. Sure. Oh, I don't have control of my background either. I can't change it to anything else. That's interesting. I wonder why I did that. Your eyes. They reminded me of the sun. Aha. Place where the sun is in the sky and not in a tower. I mean, it's interesting. More dangers by the minute. Well, it's good to have you on our side there, Alula. You were just chilling here near the water, huh? Wee. Okay, what an adventure this is turning out to be. Both in game and on my desktop. I was not anticipating that. Again, I'm not really complaining. I'm not complaining. I just, uh... Maybe I need to do more research. Alright, that's a way out. Um, let's go... Run, 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 run. Kiddos live here, but they can't get here because... Is this gonna, still going to be blocked? Yes. Uh, oh yes, this is the right place. Hi! 
I'm sorry, but we need to pick up the sun again. Uh, don't want to disturb your final resting place or anything. What? I don't want to do that, though. I would like to take it back. It is, like, a huge responsibility. And it kind of is, like, falls to me to do. Oh, I don't feel comfortable with that. But okay. Let's just run outside and see if we can reunite this family quick. Get a little happy ending, or at least a, a happy moment going before I sign off for the weekend. Hello! Oh, uh, I feel naked without the sun. Wait, I can also do this now. Sure. To the south is a peninsula. They are all standing in a fortune spot that you need to move them into the onto the darker moss if you get stuck. Ring a bell and they'll all return. Sure. Alula, give me a hand. Oh, I see. I think I messed this up already. Eh, ring a bell. Okay. I still feel like I bring this one all the way over. Maybe not all the way, all the way. Is this safe? This seems safe. Nothing else I can really do there. And then if I can... Move that down there. And then... Nope, I'm boned. I shouldn't have moved this one. Shouldn't have moved that one, because I could have gone around and done the, the, everything else I needed to do. Oh, if they all did that horrible, horrible laugh, or that horrible, horrible demon noise, I would be, I would be distraught. I would be distraught. Okay, so we put this one close. And then we move this one down. Right? That's good. And now I'm boned again. <laughs> Ugh. Okay. Because if I put them in their final resting places, I can't do anything after that. I just need to be able to move around to start with. What if I get you all the way down here? Let's get you all the way down here. This doesn't block anything off, eh? I can do this. And then I can get around here. Ah, oh, dang it! I didn't do this one yet. Back when it was useless and I didn't have to worry about it. Okay, I'm so close. I'm so close. <laughs> they rang the bell and that's how they're helping. Okay, you can go down now. Move this over one. Do, 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 do. Move this one all the way down. Because I can scoot around and do this one. And this one. And then push this one up here. And then go over here and do this. <laughs> I hope that was my reward. Ooh, Ramswool. Kind of useless. Uh, yet to be determined. We'll find out. We solve that bodacious wool puzzle. 
That was great. Well, we can reunite this family. And I can uh, shut this game down and hope it doesn't send me emails or something while I'm sleeping. <laughs> this starts sending me weird cryptic te text messages in the middle of the night or something. You gotta take your one shot, Rad. Hey! I found a Lula! Yeah, everything's good. Trapped inside the room is really scary. Well, oh, come on. Enough with the messiah talk. Weird stuff in the door. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Those strange anomalies. It's into the ruins. Good. Hmm. Yes, do tell. Square bad. Anything that touches them just sort of gets messed up. Okay. Should avoid them too. No problem. Why would it be rude? Why not? Oh! We're automatically doing it. Oh shoot. Looks like we can't get past that block. Kick it over! Yeah! Oh my goodness gracious me. Does that mean we now have a kick button? Or is that a one-time deal? Cute little house. Is there a bed here where I can have a horrible nightmare? Feather from the Great Prophet. Oh, nice. Feathers can glow in the dark and she can see into the future. She gave one of her feathers to her father before she died. I wanted to pass this down as an heirloom. It feels more fitting for you to have it. That's nice. Can we put it in our hat? Thank you. A long and slender feather with glowing edges. I don't know. I'm just having fun there. Thank you! Oh dear. Dust and cobwebs in the back room. Uh, do I think it's gonna have me go to sleep here? It's a bed. Okay, I like a mattress. Okay, those two are. What is this? Is this a. Oh, a plush toy! Cute! That's nice. Wait, their friend is a talking fox? That's pretty goo. Cool. They're good in stews. Or soups. Yee, raw fish. Well, I mean, I guess sushi if they're properly prepared. Um, am I just kind of done here? Oh! Leave your house for three days. What's this book? Yeah. Studying it. Also wrote it, also taught you how to read. Well, isn't that terribly convenient? Hang on. Check this out. Oh. Maze. She's a powerful plant spirit. She used to protect the glen once the sun died. Her health rapidly deteriorated. Aww. Yay! Yeah. In her final moments. What about this book right here? This one. That I'm holding. It means nothing to you? Dang. Well, 
I think I wouldn't take this nice peaceful moment to uh, go ahead and say my goodbyes for, for the week here. That's going to be all for me for today, and I want to thank everybody for watching, no matter where or when you happen to be. Wishing everybody out their chill vibes, and for the moment, non-contact high fives. If you find yourself in possession of a plethora of positive energy, please share it if you can spare it. And rather than thinking about your old pal, the silent G, Rad Gnarly, uh, I'd rather you uh, sent your support towards Feli, who is a member of uh, the Bruce's Gooses community that recently is not doing so hot. And uh, just want to let them know that we're, uh, we're thinking of them, and... Uh, we're still out there. Ooh, fun transition to get me back to uh, to the Zoom. Anyway, buddy, I'd like to thank everybody else for chilling with me for as long as I did. I'm going to be back Monday night. And to be frank, I haven't decided what game I'm going to be playing, so I just want to wish everybody out there a safe and happy weekend. And until we meet again, I'm going to say TTFM. Let me check out my list of buddies here. Oh, let's go ahead and uh, we're going to raid Ringtail Ferret. Thanks for hanging, everybody. See you next time.